Section. Introduction. In this section, we delve into the world of large language models, LLMs, and how they have revolutionized natural language understanding and generation. These models, trained on vast amounts of data and aligned with human preferences, have shown remarkable capabilities. However, they still have limitations in terms of size and training data. Scaling them up is costly and each model has its own strengths and specialties. This diversity raises an interesting question. Can we combine the expertise of multiple LLMs to create a more powerful model? Our answer is yes. We have identified a phenomenon called the collaborativeness of LLMs, where models perform better when they can refer to outputs from other models, even if those models are not as capable individually. Our research shows that when different LLMs work together, their performance improves significantly. This improvement occurs even when the auxiliary responses from other models are of lower quality than what a single LLM could produce on its own. Based on this discovery, we introduce a methodology called Mixture of Agents, MOA, that leverages multiple LLMs to enhance response quality iteratively. The MOA structure involves layers of agents that generate and refine responses until a robust and comprehensive output is achieved. To ensure effective collaboration and improve response quality, we carefully select LLMs based on their performance metrics and diversity of outputs for each MOA layer. By combining models with different strengths, MOA aims to overcome individual model limitations and enhance overall response quality through collaborative synthesis. Our evaluations using various benchmarks demonstrate significant improvements with MOA, achieving a state-of-the-art win rate on Alpaca Eval 2.0. Our contributions can be summarized as follows. We propose a novel framework, MOA, to enhance reasoning and language generation by leveraging multiple LLMs. We highlight the collaborativeness of LLMs, showing that they perform better when working together. And we achieve state-of-the-art performance on competitive benchmarks through our MOA framework. Section Summary In this section, we demonstrate the collaborativeness of large language models, LLMs, showing that they can enhance their responses by referencing outputs from other models. By categorizing LLMs into proposers, which provide diverse perspectives, and aggregators, which synthesize responses into high-quality outputs, we show that models like GPT-40 and Quen 1.5 excel in both roles, while Wizard LM is more effective as a proposer. To further boost collaboration, we propose using multiple aggregators iteratively to refine responses and leverage the strengths of various models, leading to the development of our mixture of agents methodology. Section. Mixture of agents. In this section, we present our mixture of agents, MOA, framework. The structure of MOA includes multiple layers, each containing several language model models, LLMs. These LLMs can be reused within the same layer or across different layers. When many LLMs in a layer are the same, it creates a setup where only a few models are activated, generating multiple different outputs due to temperature sampling stochasticity. Each LLM processes an input text and generates its continuation without needing fine-tuning. The output of each MOA layer is obtained by concatenating the texts from all LLMs and applying an aggregation and synthesis prompt. In practice, we only use one LLM in the last layer to simplify the process. Therefore, the final output is the result of the LLM in the last layer, and we evaluate the performance based on this output. Drawing inspiration from the mixture of experts, MO, technique in machine learning, MOA leverages the capabilities of multiple LLMs across different layers. In MO, expert networks specialize in different skills, and a gating network controls their contributions. Our MOA framework extends this concept to operate at the model level, using LLMs entirely through the prompt interface without modifying internal activations or weights. By consolidating the roles of gating and expert networks into LLMs, we can effectively regulate inputs and generate coherent outputs without additional coordination mechanisms. This approach eliminates the need for fine-tuning, offers flexibility, and can be applied to various LLMs regardless of their size or architecture. 
Our evaluation demonstrates that MOA achieves significant improvements on various benchmarks such as Alpaca Aval 2.0, MT Bench, and Flask. Notably, using only open source models, our method outperforms GPT 4.0 on Alpaca Aval 2.0 and Flask. Through detailed experiments and budget analysis, we show that different implementations of MOA can achieve performance comparable to GPT-4 Turbo while being more cost-effective. We evaluate our approach on benchmarks like Alpaca Eval 2.0, MT Bench, and Flask, which assess model alignment with human preferences and provide detailed performance scores. Section Summary In this section, we introduce the mixture of agents, MOA, framework, which consists of layers with multiple language model models, LLMs, that can be reused within and across layers. By leveraging a single proposer setting, where only a subset of models are activated, each LLM processes input text and generates its continuation without requiring fine-tuning. Inspired by the mixture of experts, MO, technique, our MOA method extends the concept to operate at the model level utilizing LLMs across layers solely through the prompt interface, leading to improved performance on various benchmarks while being computationally efficient and scalable. Section, Models. In this section, we created our default mixture of agents, MOA, using open source models to achieve strong performance. The models we used include Quen 1.5-110B chat, Quen 1.5-72B chat, Wizard LM minus 8 by 22B, Llama 3 to 70B Instruct 2, Mixtral minus 8 by 22B V0.1, and Instruct. We built three MOA layers with the same set of models in each layer. In the final layer, we used Quen 1.5-110B chat as the aggregator. We also developed a variant called MOA with GPT-40 which focuses on high-quality outputs by using GPT-4.0 as the aggregator in the last MOA layer. Another variant, MOA Lite, prioritizes cost-effectiveness by using only two MOA layers and Quen 1.5-72B chat as the aggregator. MOA Lite is more cost-effective than GPT-4.0 and shows a 1.8% improvement in quality on Alpaca Eval 2.0. We made sure to follow all licensing terms for the models used, and for open source models, we ran all inferences through together inference endpoint. Moving on to the benchmark results, we evaluated our approach on three benchmarks, Alpaca Eval 2.0, MT Bench, and FLASK. On Alpaca Eval 2.0, our MOA method outperformed top models like GPT-4 achieving an impressive 8.2% absolute improvement over the previous best model, GPT-40. Notably, our model surpassed GPT-40 using only open source models, showing a 7.6% absolute improvement from 57.5%, GPT-40, to 65.1%, MOA. Even with fewer layers, MOA Lite outperformed the best model by 1.8%, improving from 57.5%, GPT-40, to 59.3%, MOA Lite, showcasing the effectiveness of leveraging open source models efficiently. On MT Bench, where individual models already perform exceptionally well, our approach secured the top position on the leaderboard, demonstrating its ability to enhance performance even on highly optimized benchmarks. In Flask, MOA excelled in various aspects such as robustness, correctness, efficiency, factuality, common sense, and insightfulness compared to the single model aggregator, Quen 110B chat. MOA also outperformed GPT-4 Omni in correctness, factuality, insightfulness, completeness, and metacognition, although it was slightly less concise in its outputs. Exploring why mixture of agents works well, we conducted experiments to gain insights into its internal mechanism. We found that MOA significantly outperforms LLM rankers, indicating that the aggregator likely performs sophisticated aggregation over all proposed outputs rather than simply selecting one. Additionally, MOA tends to incorporate the best proposed answers, as shown by positive correlations between similarity scores and preference scores. Section Summary in this section, 
we constructed a mixture of agents, MOA, model using open source models to achieve competitive performance. Our MOA setup includes three layers with the same set of models in each layer, with Quen 1.5-110B chat as the aggregator in the final layer. We also developed variants like MOA with GPT-40 prioritizing high-quality outputs and MOA Lite emphasizing cost-effectiveness, showcasing significant improvements in quality on benchmarks like Alpaca Eval 2.0. Section. Effect of Model Diversity and the Number of Proposers. In this section, we examine how the number of proposals and the diversity of models impact the final output quality in our study. By adjusting the number of proposers, n, in each layer, we observe that the output quality improves as n increases, indicating the advantages of having more auxiliary information. Comparing scenarios where responses are generated by a single LLM versus multiple different LLMs, we consistently find better results when using a diverse set of LLMs. This suggests that having a greater variety of LLM agents in each MOA layer can enhance performance. Exploring the specialization of models in the mixture of agent ecosystem, we identify models like GPT-40, Quen, and LAMA-3 as versatile in both assisting and aggregating tasks. However, models like Wizard LM excel as proposers but struggle in aggregating responses from other models. To analyze the relationship between budget, token usage, and LC win rates, we conduct a budget and token analysis. By plotting the LC win rate against the average inference cost in the Aplaca Eval 2.0 benchmark, we identify models that strike a balance between cost and performance. Models closer to the Pareto front offer better value by achieving high LC win rates at lower costs. For instance, MOA is optimal for quality, while MOA Lite matches GPT-40's cost with higher quality and cost effectiveness. We also explore the consumption of TFLOPs and its impact on LC win rates, using it as a measure of latency. Similar to the cost analysis, we observe a Pareto front where models effectively utilize computational resources to maximize their performance. In the realm of LLM reasoning, Recent advancements focus on optimizing LLMs for various tasks through prompt engineering techniques like chain of thought, COT, and natural program prompting. These approaches aim to enhance the generation quality of LLMs by guiding them through reasoning processes. To leverage the strengths of multiple models, we explore model ensembles such as pair ranker for re-ranking outputs and frugal GPT for cost-effective LLM usage. Additionally, Methods like GENFUSER and model ensemble collaboration strategies are investigated to improve response quality through model fusion and multi-agent interactions.